Turning now to Pensacola, where police say a man wearing a blonde wig and carrying a toy gun was looking to get rich quick today. The two bystanders had something else in mind when he tried to rob a bank. It happened at the Whitney Bank in Pensacola. Fox 10 News reporter Carrie Chow joining us live now in the studio with the details. Carrie. Well, East investigators say 49-year-old William Jerry Strickland Jr. was walking suspiciously around Whitney Bank off Nine Mile Road in Pensacola. Investigators say Strickland was preparing to rob the bank, but there were several factors he wasn't prepared for. Now, this morning on Hallsbury Road, off-duty police officer Jamon Johnson was minding his own business when the time came to take care of business. I was at the traffic light there. Uh, I was about seven cars behind uh, the light stop line, and I observed the uh, white male um, cross over in front of me with the uh, trench coat. So I kind of kind of struck me as a little odd. Investigators say 49-year-old William Strickland Jr. was in the bank parking lot wearing a black trench coat, plastic gloves, a blonde wig, and armed with a toy gun. Investigators say the bank manager saw Strickland acting very suspicious in this parking lot, and that's when the bank manager decided not to take any chances. To see something suspicious in June, a, a white male dressed in a black trench coat, wearing a blonde wig, covering his face, it looked very suspicious. So she did the right thing by shutting down her branch. After being locked out, investigators say Strickland tried to flee. That's when Jansen Smith, the Marine reservist who happened to be in the parking lot, started chasing him. Officer Johnson saw the pursuit and quickly made a move. First thing went through my mind, this guy just robbed a bank. So I kind of knew the shortcut that they were going through. So I went on Nine Mile Road and came across where I knew they were going to end up at, which was an apartment complex. Strickland was arrested about a block from the bank. A seven-year veteran of the force, Johnson jokes it was a long shot he'd be at the right place at the right time. That time of morning, I'm very seldom up. So uh, it's just pure luck that I was up that time of morning and observed what I did. Strickland is in the Escambia County Jail on a $100,000 bond. He faces attempted robbery charges. Lenise.